Boise State football team had gone through a lot of changes a third of the way through the season, but after a bye week, they got a chance to slow down and get some extra work in as they adapt to those changes. Let's start with the quarterback. Last time out, redshirt freshman Taylor Greed made some big strides in his passing game, connecting for his first two passing touchdowns and racking up 127 yards. But as a young player, there's still plenty of room to improve, and that was a big focus for new offensive coordinator Dirk Cutter last week. He says the priorities are working on some mental mistakes like trying to limit turnovers and learning to w when to cut your losses on bad plays. He also says the key to building a quarterback up is experience and the more starts that Green gets, the more he'll start to unleash his true potential. Talon is not anything close to the quarterback right now that he's going to be. And the only way you get better at that is through experience, through live reps. We haven't had to rely on our passing game because we've had a strong running game. There's going to come a time when we are going to need our passing game. We had a lot of time in the classroom, but then on the field, those, those three bonus days of practice where we could just take certain concepts and work on concepts that we're going to carry through throughout the season, uh, that, that was beneficial. Now, you know, the payoff doesn't come until game day, so, you, you know, we won't know that. Now, Coach Cutter has also had strength in the BSU run game since he joined. The Broncos have rushed for over 300 yards in back-to-back -back games. That hadn't happened for a BSU team since 2000 when, guess what, Dirk Cutter was the head coach. One of the keys has been simplifying the run game. BSU has started to reuse some of the same plays multiple times to give running backs a second try. It's been effective. It's a tip that Cutter picked up from his days coaching in the NFL. I mean, I was fortunate to be around some great running backs, Fred Taylor, Maurice Jones-Drew, uh, Steven Jackson and those guys all tell you they need to see the looks more than one time as coaches I'm, I know I was guilty of this plenty of times you run a run in the first quarter and you gain two yards and then you don't run that run again the rest of the game if you've watched us the last two weeks I mean our run game is nothing is nothing fancy we run the same plays but I think when the guys get to see the same looks more than a couple times in a game it helps them.